What's going on everyone? Juicebags here and welcome back to some Dungeon Defenders 2. I'm about to do what I've been saying for the last several years that I'm never going to do and that is give you the top three hero damage heroes in Dungeon Defenders 2. Now the reason I have just never been willing to do this as it's such an opinion based thing uh, saying that anything is the best without qualifying it as far as the highest one-shot damage, the most survivable, the best CC. Just saying what hero is the best overall is 100% just completely opinionated based. I mean, no other way to put it. Uh, now, today we're going to take a look at hero damage heroes. Now, this is heroes that focus on the hero damage stat that primarily focus on their primary two attacks. So the primary fire and the alternate fire. Now coming in here at number three, we've got the lovely EV2. The EV2 is super strong and out of the charged shot based heroes, any of the hero damage heroes that will use charged shot, meaning Apprentice, Adept, Huntress, EV2, the EV2 is going to put out the most overall damage. Uh, that is just without a doubt, and it's actually leaps and bounds above the OG heroes. Now, this one came in at number three for one main reason, and that is the build is 100% dependent on charge shot. That's a Chaos 7 shard, and a lot of newer players, as they're progressing through the game, are not going to have this shard available. Now, with that in mind, any hero damage hero out of these listed, the Apprentice, Adept, Huntress, or EV2, are just not going to be at maximum power in any hero damage build without having Charge Shot. So, Charge Shot is a requirement in any of these heroes and the ranged heroes that can use the shard that focus on hero damage. Now number two, we've got the Barbarian. The Hero Damage Barbarian is just an absolute beast. It's not going to put out as much damage as an Ability Power Barbarian. However, one thing can be said about the Barb, and that is you just don't kill him. Now, the Barbarian, of course, can be playable in Hero Damage, Ability Power, or Hero Health, dependent on how you want to play your Barb and how you want to deck him out. But if you like hack and slash, and if you like tank and spank, and if you like getting up into baddies' faces with some wild swinging, then without a doubt the Barbarian is the hero for you. It's just the best melee hero in the game. Whether it be as hero damage or ability power, it is just the best one out there. Now this brings us along to number one, and of course number one, you know I'm going to put the Nuke Monk. Any hero that can do as much range damage with their alternate fire as most heroes do with their primary fire is okay with me. Now, you take that and you also add in the ability to do those massive, massive one-shots, and that makes the Monk the obvious choice for number one. Uh, the Monk and the Barbarian can both break that 2 billion DPS cap uh, with anti-mod stacking of course however the monk is the only one that can do it with hero damage the barb takes an ability power build to get that job done and the monk is without a doubt in my opinion the number one hero damage hero in the game besides having the versatility of playing the monk as ranged or as melee one of the big kickers with the monk is to get that big power shot all you need is the Crane Stance Shard. So a Chaos 1 Shard in any hero damage build, stacking hero damage on your gear, is going to give you one super mean monk. No doubt about it. Now that will do it for my top three hero damage heroes in Dungeon Defenders 2. However, I just can't go without mentioning and giving an honorable mention to the Mighty Squire. The Squire is going to follow some of the same mechanics in the Monk as far as swinging, plus also has a self buff and taunt that can really help you out in your hack and slash builds. So if you like to get up in enemies faces but you don't yet have the barb, the Squire is going to be the one for you as it is just a hack and slash master, no doubt about it. 
So an honorable mention goes to the Squire. Did not make the top three list. However, certainly one meaty, meaty hero. And for those that have been watching, there is a hero giveaway that ends tonight at midnight Pacific time. It is not too late to enter. Head on over to my channel and get yourself into that hero giveaway. Now, in addition to that, I will be live today over on Twitch at noon Pacific time or 1 p.m. Pacific time, depending on whether or not chromatic streams with some live DD2 action. And I'll be doing hero and flare code giveaways throughout. Now, this does mean that Juicy Head Flare is going out today over on Twitch. Now, as I mentioned earlier, this is 100% in my opinion. Uh, we've all got our opinions and it's really impossible to classify what is best at something without giving some more parameters. There is no doubt there. However, that will do it for now. So thank you all so much for watching. Make sure to click that like button and please subscribe to the channel. I will be back soon with more Dungeon Defenders 2. I'll see you then.